Hello, Brian Reed here with Firewalls.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to physically set up the AT&T Velocity USB 3G modem to be used with a sonic wall firewall. For this demonstration, we need four items. We need our universal IT tool, also known as the paperclip. We've got our 3G iPhone that's on the AT&T network. We have our AT&T Velocity 3G modem. You can pick this up, you know, pretty much anywhere for 30, 40 bucks. And then finally, we have our SonicWall TZ200 firewall. Now, note that uh, this will also work on the SonicWall NSA240 and the NSA2400 series, every model, except on the 2400, it won't allow you to to do Windows load balancing. Okay, so let's begin. So we take our universal IT tool and at the top of our phone is a little pinhole. Stick the paper clip in there and that will come your AT&T SIM card. Go ahead and remove that from the carriage. Then on the AT&T Velocity card on the back we slide the back off. As you can see there's a little spot here for the SIM card. So we go ahead and slide it in there and return the back. And we'll go ahead and open up the USB connection. Then on the SonicWall TZ200, on the side you will see there's a little connection here called the U0. It's got the USB symbol. And that is where we plug in the AT&T USB modem. Okay, so that's all there is to prepping the SonicWall firewall to use the AT&T Velocity USB 3G modem using your iPhone SIM card. Also keep an eye out, we've got several more videos coming in regards to how to configure the modem as well as how to set up the sonic wall to accept the connection as well as load balancing and other features. Okay, we hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions or comments, please enter them in the section below. Have a great day.